YouTubers, good morning. I'm trying to get my heat figured out here. Mike Martin's here with the Mike Martin channel. Welcome to Morning Coffee with your man, Mike. Guys, thanks for joining me. Ah, put my armrest there. I'm off to drop off a pile of mail and to pick up, what am I picking up? Yeah, some food for the shop. I've been eating more at the shop lately, making my own coffee lately, and uh, instant coffee. Nescafe is working really well for me. I like it, it's good, it tastes good, it's strong. And that, you know, so. Anyways, happy Wednesday morning. Today's like my Monday, technically. I work till Saturday at the shop. And I cut back on my hours. Uh, so I get I, I do I do more work from home actually believe it or not I actually get a lot done from home and uh, the shop is busy the shop's been really busy I've been allocating my hours uh, and nice tight couple of days and it's been doing really well it's a small town so people you know people come and and they know that the, the days and uh, I'm open days I'm closed so they they already know in town I updated it on Google and on Facebook and uh, a week or two ago so people know and that's that you know you gotta especially when owning your own business guys you want to cater hours you don't want to overwork too when you start overworking you start to just to, to realize you start wasting time right valuable time you could be spending with your family valuable time you could be doing uh, other stuff maybe researching or reading or doing other things or being part of something bigger but yeah, I just kind of wanted to throw that out there this morning, guys. So the CV virus, um, I'm, I've been monitoring other countries uh, right now and seeing where they're at when it comes to um, their outbreaks. So it, it seems in other countries, it's been more stabilized. Everything out, basically every country outside of China that has any infected cases. I think the Philippines had one, but they shipped them out. Or the one guy that had it, uh, that died in the Philippines, actually was from Wuhan, from China. So, so everybody else that was in contact with them looked like they all tested negative. So we're gonna wait another two more weeks before I decide whether or not I go to the Philippines. So I've been watching like Malaysia. I've been watching. Um, all those other countries in another two weeks we'll know for sure where things sit right uh, a lot of people that have contracted the the CV virus have 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 successfully um, not a lot of people but some of the people that contracted sorry some of the people that contracted the CV virus have successfully uh, cleared it right so I, I don't know what kind of a toll it does on the on the, on the human lifespan. If it knocks a few years off your lifespan because of uh, the simple fact of um, the simple fact of um, what damages it could internally potentially do, right? So that cruise ship, everyone's catching the virus because they're pretty much those, those cruise ships. So. It's spreading amongst folks in there because they're in an isolated area, right? So they're in an isolated area. I think it's, it's spreading through the ventilation systems and people might get it and then people might, you know, might successfully recover from it, right? So we're going to keep an eye on it for the next two weeks, right? And if it does start to simmer down and we start getting... Um, like China, we can't depend on the Chinese numbers. I already said this a gazillion times. Chinese numbers, forget it. We're not gonna, we're gonna, we're not gonna, yeah, it's not gonna fly with that, right? And, um, in other news, I saw Bernie Sanders winning his, where, where was it, Wisconsin? I can't remember where it was. I was watching it. He won there for the, uh, Democrats. So, it looks like, uh, for the Democrats, uh, I'd like Tulsi, uh, Tulsi to, to, uh, Tulsi Gobart to, um, to advance, uh, because she's a, a good, she'd be a good challenge. You know, if you want to see a good election and a good, uh, challenge, you want Tulsi to be in the, you know, one of the primaries there because she'd actually bring it, 
uh, you know, if she was given the chance. But it looks like everyone's still on Bernie's modified socialism, everybody gets everything type of thing, and then he kind of pulls back and says he'd bankrupt the country, and then he goes back. Uh, I think Elizabeth Warren is finished. I think Joe, Joe, creepy Joe Biden is finished. I think a lot of those people are done. I don't know. I'm just kind of throwing that out there. But it looks like that Bernie might have uh, his day. His day, yeah. He was stolen. He lost. He was stolen. When uh, last election, he he would have been a good front runner against Trump. But then when Hill Dog proceeded to steal the uh, the primaries there, I felt sorry for the guy. I really did. And that's why I was pulling hard for Trump after that. I was pulling really hard for Trump after uh, Bernie Sanders was kind of uh, taken for a ride, so to say. He lost a lot of money campaigning and this and that. And, 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 and you know what I'm saying? Um, losing money. Joe Biden's been leaking, hemorrhaging money. He's not getting the donations. He's He's having a really tough time from what I've been seeing, right? So, I wish everyone good luck in this, but it's going to be a really good 2020. This is going to be the election of elections. I'll be covering it on the channel, uh, of course, when it when it when the proceed when everything starts. I'll be covering it, guys. Sorry, guys, I'm yawning like a dog here this morning. Holy smokes! I'm still waking up. Unfortunately, it's been uh, somewhat of a long night. And you know what I've been doing at nights, guys, a lot, actually, lately? It's been good for me. I've been reading a lot. I actually have been picking up a storybook, you know? I used to read a lot of business books, but none of the business is going according to plan that it should be. If you're following the, the, the business logistics of things, of logistics, following the logistics, following this, following that, you would, you know go by the book and you'd follow the plan, you'd invest properly, you'd look for the future, but nothing, everything, it's all derivatives, it's all um, deleveraging of, uh, of, of companies and, and, and companies going uh, insolvent, nothing is going by the book, you get the repo markets, you got a lot of companies that should be faltering and, 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 and going bankrupt, but you're not getting that, right? And nothing is going by the book, why? Because taxpayers keep funding Companies that should, you know, go go bankrupt. You know what I'm saying? But we'll see what happens. It looks like the CV virus is going to take a toll on the Apple new release for the new phone, apparently. And I'm looking at the S20 for myself, the the um, the new S20 for Android because I do a lot of video. And the S20, the S20 Ultra, S, S, S20 Ultra, whatever. That one's a really good phone because the camera. The camera is by far, and because I use a camera 24-7, I would like to hopefully get one when it releases. I'm not a big phone guy. I still have my, my cell phone here that I've had for three years now making this video. But I need to upgrade to something better, something faster, something that can up, uh, you know, upload faster, all kinds of stuff, right? And it does have 5G, 5G capabilities, so we'll see about that. What else? Yeah, you know, just uh, kind of interesting, you know, I Survive 2020 t-shirts. I should make those uh, for, the, um, for, the, for the store, uh, Mike Martin Swag. I Survived 2020. Uh, we're already in, what, second week of February, and you've had these massive fires in Australia. You've had the CV virus going rampant. you got this, this, this all kinds of markets going nuts. you got just just all kinds of things happening at once, and we're, we're not even six, seven weeks into the, seven weeks into the year. Wow. Okay, guys, I'm going to go send out some mail, and I'm going to do some grocery shopping. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Lots of love. Remember, eye on the prize. And guys, the only way to fear, the only way to extinguish fear or to eliminate fear is to love. Thanks for watching.